Well, welcome everybody. You join us here for our coverage of what is set to be a truly exciting final. Formalities are underway. Everybody is soaking up an energetic, highly charged atmosphere within the ground. The teams will be with us very shortly. We look forward, of course, to that special moment. In the meantime, we take in the feeling of excitement and euphoria ahead of what should be a really outstanding final. This is the gladiatorial arena that is the Stadio Olimpico, for so long the symbol of Rome's grand sporting history. The national anthem of Argentina rings out. performance and now here comes the response Teams, Jim, eyeing the ultimate prize here, unerring focus and determination in all of those eyes. Bringing back memories for me, Peter, a chance to have your name in the club's history. Having had the privilege of experiencing this uh, a fair few times in my own career, there really is nothing that compares. Once you get there, you want to keep coming back. I still feel like that now. This is it. Look, we can only hope for a final that will be... Whistle's gone, that's a foul. Aguero. Spinazzola did well to emerge with the ball. That's a contest to keep an eye on. Spinazzola up for the header. No, oh, he couldn't get the direction he needed. Immobile really showed that he wanted it more than anyone else, but maybe heading requires extra practice. Nice touch. Lorenzo Insigne. And he's made sure that that won't get through. Hoists it forward. Chiellini gets it back. Back to the keeper and go again. Lorenzi, Jorginho plays it forward, that's a decent ball, Florenzi, and it's played forward, dashing forward at pace, Correa goes looking, it's Aguero, and he's there to hoof it away. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. <laughs> and 
neither side yet able to find the net. Lo Celso. Taliafico. And here's Correa. Oh, the defence got the better of him this time, but I'm sure he'll go again. Just shoots! Oh, what a wonderful stop! Immobile sparked a tremendous stop there, and I think it's fair to add, he just wasn't expecting it. Martinez and it's Messi he gets past his man just brushed off the ball there Berati very firm in standing his ground there it is a tough full contact contest Chiesa battles to win it back Otamendi. Lo Celso. Correa. Lo Celso plays it out to the wing. Jorginho. Oh, that's clearly not what he wanted to do. Lo Celso, forward it goes. Messi, now it's has a hit. Oh, that's a terrific save from the keeper. Oh, that's a sparkling save, absolutely sparkling. His reflexes were ultra sharp. There's the whistle. The first half of the final has flown by. So neither team has broken through, but certainly not for the want of trying. It's been an interesting game up to now, but still goalless. So we've had the first 45 minutes of the final, Jim. How's it looking for you? Look, this is classic final tension and, and nerves. Um, it's still got time to go from tentative to thrilling, I hope. Well, after 45 minutes, it is still goalless. A change, perhaps, after half-time. And the game has already resumed here. No score in the first half. Who's ready to go for it now? And it's Jorginho. Berardi. <laughs> well, there's something you don't see every day. Argentina being made to look sloppy in possession here. And here's Aguero. Aguero! Oh, the keeper's done ever so well. Well, you can't ask for much more than that. A difficult moment he simply had to deal with. Pinazzola. Insigne. Tried to play it through. Yeah, the idea was right. The delivery wasn't. They can revisit that further on. 
And it's messy. Well, that looks a foul. Yep, referee's given it. Otamendi tries to get it forward quickly. Jorginho. It's a loose ball. It's Martinez! It's anyone's ball. Well, I think when you're in that situation, all you can do is, is tip your hat to the keeper because that was fantastic. So, time for changes on both sides, actually. Oh, that's a waste. And it's hoisted clear. That's a throw. Defended that had to be done. Insignia brings the ball forward, and the whistle has gone for a reckless challenge there. And he has shown him a yellow card. Berateski. Jorginho. What a ball this has turned out to be. Cut out in the nick of time. Away from immediate danger. Berateski. Berateski drives it forward. Look, this can still go either way. It might be flowing one way, but there's still time for some ebb. That's an untidy challenge. Free kick given. The referee has resisted the temptation to go to his pocket. It's just a stern lecture. right from the top draw that could turn out to be a big big goal dispatched expertly nicely done Both sides then taking this chance to turn to their benches. Yeah, he's run himself into the ground, hasn't he? And it's, it's good to see that the crowd appreciate his efforts because he has put in a real honest shift. Argentina have made their breakthrough, so can they build on it? Immobile. Insignia! Big relief, it just needed better contact. Well, he did get himself into a good position something for him to cling to. How many interceptions have we seen now? Someone's got to up the quality and, and set an example. So not long left in this now. 
Italy are on the point of first round elimination. And it's Insigne. Oh, great ball! Chooses to go back. Barella! Yes! We thought it was over. It's all square once more. Italy produced a lovely sequence of passes there. It's a terrific brand of football to watch. And importantly, it is a strong end product. And when the manager called on him, he was only too happy to repay that save. That's how you make an impact as a sub. You know, when most are tiring, you can impose a freshness and energy to best effect. What an introduction. All square again into the dying minutes. Questions were asked, but he's given the answers. You wonder if that's it now, but there may be one more opportunity, Peter, for a late, late steal here. Martinez plays it forward. Timely intervention. Into stoppage time, whistle due any moment. Barrera hits that long. Nothing to separate them. We have extra time. Well, I don't think either manager can have any complaints, really, because nobody quite pushed for the winning goal, and it always lacked that spark. Well, fitness and fatigue, the key factors now as we head for extra time. The whistle goes, we're off and running. Italy displayed great character to force extra time from what looked a pretty ominous situation. The question now is, can they go on to win it? It is doable. Immobile. And they've been caught out here. And the shot! He can pounce on that. And somehow he managed to miss it. Bernadeschi has delivered a really costly miss. It could have been their last chance to win it. Jorginho. Now it's Aguero. Yeah, he's fouled him there. Aguero gets it out to the wing. Messi. The corner it is then. He just whacks it away. And it's played forward. Otamendi gets into the right position to intercept. Dinks one in. Oh, he's managed to get himself offside. Immobile has created one. We've reached the midway point in extra time. Well, it may well be a case of who's got most to give now. Fitness levels look good, and it's not any less competitive. And we're on the way. The last 15 minutes, the closing stretch of a marathon final. Oh, good interception. A real chance to break. Has he picked him out? It's found its way to him. 
Berateski. Berateski. Barella! Oh, real danger here. Played out to the right. Barella spreads it towards the left. Has a pop! Brilliant from Immobile! Late in the day, this could well be it! Well, you know, thinking about that, I think they've perfected that on the training ground because it took them seconds to get the ball from back to front and they really commit forward in numbers too. It was all very well drilled. Italy get themselves into the lead. Surprise, surprise. He just keeps on delivering and, listen, we all expect that. Finds himself eased off the ball. Lo Celso. He's had a go! Oh, he did the hard part right, but fluffed the finish. Well, there are a few pockets of space that are being exploited and they need filling and fast. Chiellini is there to heave it away. Argentina have to get it into the box and quickly. A long ball, but not especially accurate. Well, it remains to be seen whether they can come up with that little bit of class to rescue the situation, and it needs to be any time now, really. It has gone out. Martinez has been caught there, it's a foul. Acuna. Di Maria. Goal! Well, that's confidence for you. Distance doesn't even bother him. And time is up. Italy have done it here. Winners of the Konami Cup. A massive moment in their lives. What a moment this is for all connected with the team. It's a day for pride, a day for glory. Another grand chapter to be added to their glittering history.